In the depths of space, on a small blue planet called Earth, a young boy named Mason dreamt of becoming an astronaut. He spent hours gazing up at the stars, imagining himself floating weightlessly among them. One day, as he was exploring the woods behind his house, he stumbled upon a small rabbit. It was pure white, with bright red eyes that seemed to glow in the sunlight. Mason was immediately drawn to the rabbit and decided to take it home as a pet. He named her Scarlet. Mason and Scarlet quickly became inseparable. They spent their days exploring the woods and playing by the river. Mason loved watching Scarlet hop around, her fluffy tail bouncing behind her. He would often sit and watch her for hours, lost in thought. One day, while they were playing in the woods, Scarlet suddenly darted off into the underbrush. Mason chased after her, calling her name. He eventually caught up to her, but as he reached down to pick her up, he noticed something strange. Scarlet's eyes had turned a deep shade of red, and she was staring at him with an intense, almost menacing look. Mason was taken aback by Scarlet's sudden change in demeanor. He tried to pick her up, but she squirmed out of his grasp and ran off into the woods. Mason followed her, determined to figure out what was going on. As he chased after her, he noticed that the woods around him had become darker and more foreboding. The trees seemed to loom over him, casting long shadows across the forest floor. Mason felt a sense of unease creeping over him, but he pushed it aside and continued on. Eventually, he caught up to Scarlet again. This time, she was perched on a large rock, staring out into the woods. Mason approached her cautiously, but as he got closer, he heard a low growling sound coming from the underbrush. Mason's heart began to race as he realized that something was stalking them in the woods. He tried to pick up Scarlet and run, but she refused to budge. Instead, she hopped off the rock and began to lead Mason deeper into the woods. As they walked, Mason began to notice strange markings on the trees. They looked like claw marks, but they were too large to have been made by any animal he knew of. He felt a shiver run down his spine as he realized that they were being hunted by something that was not of this world. Finally, after what felt like hours of walking, Scarlet led Mason to a small clearing in the woods. In the center of the clearing stood a large, glowing portal. Mason stared at it in awe, realizing that this was the reason he and Scarlet had been brought here. Without hesitation, Mason stepped through the portal, with Scarlet following closely behind. As they emerged on the other side, they found themselves floating weightlessly in space. The stars and planets whirled around them, and Mason felt a sense of wonder and excitement that he had never experienced before. As they floated through the cosmos, Mason realized that he had achieved his dream of becoming an astronaut. He had traveled to the farthest reaches of the universe with his loyal companion by his side. And although he knew that he would never be able to return to Earth, he was content knowing that he had found his true purpose in life. In the end, Mason and Scarlet lived out the rest of their days exploring the vast expanse of space, discovering new worlds and galaxies that no one had ever seen before. And although they were far from home, they knew that they had found a new home among the stars. The End